Hello viewers, today's question was gotten from one of my students and this is an assignment. And in this assignment, I want to show you how you can obtain or write the equation of a circle when you're giving all of this information. Okay, I'm going to do A and B for you, then I'll allow you to do C and put your answer in the comment section, okay? Now let us get started with how to write the equation of a circle with all of this information. Now, first thing you should know is that a circle can be represented in this format, okay? Uh, y, x minus h, r squared plus y minus k, r squared equal to r squared. Yes, this h and this k is the center of the circle and this arrow is the radius of the circle. So in this case, we have the center and we have the radius. So if there's no problem, we are good to go with solving it. At this point, you can see that the h here is minus 1 and the k is what? 2. So this is how we put up the coordinates. So the first coordinate is the h and the second is the k. So now in this case, my h is minus 1. So I'm going to come over here and plug in minus 1 here. So I have minus 1 squared plus y minus, my k here is 2, so y minus 2 squared, then equal to, radius is 4, 4 squared. So, at this point, you know, minus minus 1, we're going to round up to be x plus 1 all squared plus y minus 2 all squared equal to 4 squared. Okay, viewers, this is how we can write the equation of a circle when we are given all of this information. And as a matter of fact, this form is called the standard form of a circle. Now, if they ask you to put this equation in a general form, so that means you're going to expand all these guys and get the general form of a circle. For this one, this one is called the standard form. This is called the standard form. Then if you're asked to put the equation of a circle in a general form, then we go ahead and expand this guy. So let us expand it. So uh, we have x plus 1 all squared plus y minus 2 all squared equal to 4 squared here is 16. Okay? So the next thing you want to do is to expand this guy. When you expand x plus 1, you have x squared plus um, 2x plus 1. Okay? Then if you expand this guy, you get y squared uh, minus 4y plus 4, then equal to what? 16. Now, the next thing you want to do is to take all these guys, this constant term, to the other side of the equation. So you have x squared plus 2x, uh -huh, then plus y squared uh, minus 4y, of course, equal to 16 minus 1 and minus 4. And all these guys will become um, 11 because you see minus 1 is 15, then minus 4 is 11. So I have x squared plus 2x plus y squared minus 4y and you may want to rearrange it very well so you have x squared plus y squared then plus 2x minus 4y minus 11 equal to 0. Now viewers this is how we write the equation of a circle this is called a general form this is a general form on how we represent the equation of a circle and this one is called the standard form. So you can now go ahead and solve the other example. And um, okay, meet me in the next video. I will solve the other example in the next video. Okay.